today I was trying to figure out what do I want to talk about on my weekly video and then I realized the thing that is so cool for all of us at Transition is right under our nose. Watch this. Pageant from the Change Guru. I'm a coach, a speaker, a writer, and today on this week's vlog, I was wondering what do I want to talk about? And I kind of waited to the last second to just for some inspiration to come to me. And I knew that it would, and it came to me in the most simple but profound way. And it reminded me how often the things that are so simple and so cool are really important to us now as we make the transition in midlife. Now speaking of transition, a lot of us are making career change. We want to do something different with our work, but because some of us have been stay-at-home moms for a long time, or we're doing a certain type of career, that we're moving into another career, we sometimes discount our past. And one thing that I've come to know is that it's a lot of the stuff that's in our past that's actually a gold mine, that we're sitting on some fantastic credentials and wonderful experiences, but for whatever reason, whether it's because of like time we've been away from doing them or because, you know, we just kind of undersell ourselves a bit, we've just forgotten about them. So anyways, today I was having, um, having lunch with a friend and she's an awesome mom and she's like me, she's a uni student, she's gone back to school, but she told me that in a, in a past life she was a pilot. She flew planes, she flew helicopters, she was in the military, and I just thought that was absolutely incredible that my friend was this amazing thing. And in a way, maybe she, you know, didn't write, think too much of it, but it just reminded me so much. Look back on your past. Look back at the things that you've been doing in your life, and you might be surprised. Tell your friends what you used to do. They may be able to identify the cool thing that you used to do that you're kind of thinking is no big deal. Now, what does that apply to today? It doesn't mean that my friend is going to go back and be a chopper pilot, but it does remind her of the passion that she had when she was a chopper pilot and maybe some of the skills, some of the things that she loved so much about doing that job are new things that she can do in her new transitional career that she's going to go into. So look back at your past, even at the tough things. If there were tough things that you not only survived, but you thrived in doing, those could be experiences that could also be parlayed into a new career. All right, so those are some ideas of ways to transition using some of the things you already have. Great, huh? Hey, if there's anything that you've done in your past that you're just curious if it's something that you could turn into something that's cool, send me an email at susan at thechangeguru.net. I also talk about all this kind of stuff in my book, Be Your Own Change Guru, The Ultimate Women's Guide for Thriving at Midlife. That's going to be on sale January 2014, and I talk about all different ways to identify career strengths and the special things that you can do specifically at Midlife. Okay, I'm going to enjoy the rest of my beautiful boat ride on Sydney Harbor. Um, have a fantastic, fantastic day. Thank you for listening, and I look forward to seeing you soon. Bye for now. Something that's right under my nose, see it all the time, and it's a little bit of gold, huh?